Hello friends, welcome to Susan and John MacTube. In this video, we will learn how to use our calculator to find inverse normal value. That is, suppose the probability of a standard normal value is given. Let's say it is given like 0.05. And I want to know what is the value of A. By the way, let me make it very clear. If you want to use your calculator to find the inverse normal value, then you should be aware that we need less than or less than or equal to. That means if you ever see probability of Z greater than A, you have to forcefully convert it into 1 minus probability Z less than or equal to A. So point number one, the inequality should be less than or less than or equal to. And let me repeat, we will use inverse normal probability whenever the probability value is given. Now in testing of hypothesis, this comes regularly because when you calculate the tabulated value, you might want to find set 0.001. That means the probability value of a number is given here to be 0 0.001. So basically for all these purposes, we can use the calculator and it will be very easy to use the calculator compared to the standard normal table. So let's start. So take your calculator on and menu and you will see the standard normal graph that is 7 and click it and you'll see the inverse normal value. Now the most important point is Area means probability because the graph of any probability function will be above the x-axis. Because probability, finding probability of any equations means integration. And integration for a positive graph means area. So basically, if they have given probability z less than a equal to 0 0.05, find the value of a. So now I know that the area value from minus infinity to one particular number is 0 0.05. If they give me probability z less than or equal to b, is equal to 0 0.94 then I will understand in the standard normal graph from minus infinity to a number called B the area will be 94 percentage how much area will be covered 94 percentage and I want B so basically you have to plug in the given probability value by the way in testing of hypothesis you will see 0 0.1 so the area value is given to be 0 0.1 whatever in this problem we will plug in area equal to 0 0.05 and now no need to touch this or this because it's a standard normal graph and if you have um, a non-standard graph you can convert it into the standard normal graph because normally we convert it and that's it so don't forget it's n01 ah that's it we got the inverse value that means the value of a where probability z less than a is equal to 0 0.05 is minus 1.645 now you have to understand one more very 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 important thing especially when it comes to testing Look at this. This means the area below minus 1.645 is 0 0.05. Also, the area after 1.645 is 5 percentage because of the symmetry. Anyway, this is your required answer. So, I'll give you one question. Suppose probability of Z less than or equal to B is equal to 0 0.1. Can you find the value of B and put it in the comments? Let's see how many of you can do it. And I want you to use a calculator and not the tables. I'll be back with another video. So till then my friends, bye.